Hi, it's Adrian. How are you doing today? And so I'm back with another uh, Walmart uh, haul and another look from the Relove by Revolution, which is being sold in Walmart. So I thought I'd go ahead and get started. I did go ahead and use the Alpha Halo Glow as my primer. I have it in one fair, so that's what I went ahead and used there. And then I did go ahead and use the Super Serum uh, by Relove, which is by Revolution. Um, all of their products are $5 and under, so um, the, this is uh, one of their foundations. It's in F2 and it runs right at $5. And then as far as going ahead and um, doing my bronzer, um, I did pick up the Contour, and this one's in sugar. I think it's the um, lightest one, or at least when I checked the website, it looked like it was the lightest one. And I'm going by, yeah, um, I did check the website. So this is what I used for my bronzer today. And this is what I used for my highlight as well. Um, I didn't use this as a blush. And then uh, what I did go ahead and use was I picked up these baby tints that are supposed to be like the, uh, yeah, they're supposed to be like the uh, benefit tints. And this one's in coral. And so I went ahead and used it on my lips. And I used it on the cheeks as well. I did add in actually at the beginning I didn't know if this would have any color to it so I did put a little bit of the pillow talk uh, peach gasm in there but I don't think I would have needed this I just kind of did it it's a first impression and I'm not quite sure how to do um, yet but like I said I went ahead and used this uh, the bronzer here the highlight here and this um, and again, a little bit of the Charlotte Tilbury Peach Gasm as well. And so that's what I have on the cheeks. I do have the next Thicket Stick It. And this is what I have on my brows. And um, in this haul, I did go ahead and pick up the uh, Power Lash Volume. And so this is the pink one that is actually a black mascara and that's what the wand looks like it's a pretty regular wand and this is what I have on my lashes today uh, when I first um, yeah on my first haul for this line I went ahead and picked up uh, this one which I didn't think it was actually pink mascara but it is and the mascaras let's see are both running at about three dollars a piece i think and the baby tents are running at three dollars a piece as well so you know it's nice full size so his tents i don't think are full size but oh, it's, a, it's three dollars you know but anyway so onto the eyes and i did go ahead and get the fearless um, and both of these are running, yeah, they're both running at $3 as well. Let's see. Yeah, there they are. So, um, as far as what I did here, started with Fearless Palette. And um, this is what I use for the eyeshadows. You do get six eyeshadows. This one is called Fearless. And... I went ahead and used this one right under the brow. I used the orange right in the crease. Um, used this color on the outer corner and uh, used this one on the lid. The yellow I went ahead and used right on the inside of the eye. And then I did use a little bit of that right under the brow as well. And uh, really, really pretty color story here. This is how it ended up looking. And um, I think I might go ahead and use a little bit. Yeah, we could use a little bit of the fun stuff here as an eyeliner. So I think I'll go ahead and start with a little bit of this as far as the eyeliner goes. And 
and then we can go ahead and add in maybe a little bit more here. Got my makeup face here. And then a little bit of the orange, so a little bit of this one. And how about a little bit of the yellow as well? So this yellow here. So there we go. There's how the eye look uh, turned out with going ahead and using a little bit of the eyeshadow as, um, yeah, didn't use this color. Um, but again, I'm just having a lot of fun with these. Again, these are running at $3. The mascara is running at $3 as well. Uh, the baby tint, which I used on the lips and also on the cheeks, is running at $3. I do have a couple of things that aren't running at $3. Um, I did go ahead and use the Butter Glow as my finishing powder on this. And so this one is by Physicians Formula. The color on this one is a translucent. And so that's what I have on as my finishing powder. And um, I think that's going to be the video. Um, I definitely suggest this. These, uh, the shadows and, well, everything I've tried so far has a lot of pigment and blends really well. So, yes, i thinking that, you know, that Revolution uh, found the right place at the right ta time. And they've done so much of this that they definitely know how to do these kind of looks. So um, thank you, and I hope that you have a good day.